going to see the connection of water closets so how to use the how to connect the pipes to the water closets so what are the connection types you will see in this tutorial right so now we have to open our revit mep software right so here we can see the revit mep so here we have opened right so now go to new project so you have to go to your new plumbing project if you have separate templates so you can open your plumbing template right first of all uh, we can see change our units by pressing un so like that we change the unit so for here we have to go to the sub -listen planners plumbing right count apply so it will change to plumbing right so this duplicate so we can delete this right Chaining and chaining its name. Right. I'm chaining a simple right. If you want you can change like that, or here we have the problems like plumbing, right? What is out? So we're having the two levels, right? So now uh, here we have some pictures, right? So the plumbing connection over the tab here. So here we have the pipe, the pipe fitting, and the pipe accessories and the flex pipe. So here we have the main content of our plumbing, right? So all our loads projects will be loaded from this plumbing pictures, like the sink, the bathtub, or the water closets. Everything will be fit here, right? So here we have the sprinklers, right? So the sprinklers for our fire, emergency fire, heating, so like that. So we will go to our plumbing pictures. So here we can see our properties, right? So here we have M-Sync and it's a double M-Sync. This is mopping sink. For you can place it near the corners. So and these are the types of water closets. So these are the power flushing greater than 6.1 6.1 like so like this if you want to load go to load family so here we get in the plumbing components go to fixtures so here we have some appliances like dishwasher washing machine everything we can place and here we have some bathtubs so here we have the pipe connectors connections and these are the flow drains these are some emergency pictures here we have the different types of sinks so here we can see the sinks right and these are the showers and these are some urinals so these are some water projects here you can see right so for if you want to place here so we need a building or a structure so we will go to here architect browser so here we go in revit map also we are going to have the architectural toolbars because we can make the modification to our building also for that go to wall so i'm going to take a single wall over here to show you guys right so i'm taking this as direct printer so now we need to if we select here we go to 3d so we can see our walls right
So here we have the generic call, right? So now we will go to our plan. That is plumbing floor plan. So now we need to go to our plumbing pictures. So I'm taking this water closets. So I'm taking the private one. So here it will it will select some options, right? If you want to, so select this and deselect this. So and we have the diameter of the pipes, right? So I'm going to take a uh, 40 mm for example. So for this here we can see there is a connection if you place here so it shows some dot right so select on this select over here right so unselect this so here we can see our connection right so same like that only again go to this point select this one and go over here right so same again go to here so and again select this distance like this so we have connected from here right so if we go to realistic so we can see our pipe has connected right so we can modify this length right so i'm taking s 200 and this also as 1200 right and this one also as 1200 <laughs> Now here we can see we have connected our water closet with pipes, right? So now we need to connect these three pipes. So if you go to again the floor plan, So we have placed it in the ceiling and right. So if we go to 3D. So we can draw this in 3D also, right? So now I will connect these pipes. So I'm going to select over here. Again to this point. Right, so again go to home, select the pipe, select from here, and select to this and over here, right? So now we need to connect this. Select over here, it automatically it will connect here, right? Then go to pipe, select over here. We have connection over here. 
in current is not so if we go to click launch here you can see so if we go to realistic and click on file so see here it is connected right <coughs> If we go over here, <coughs> so here we can see the T joint, right? So this is the T joint, like we usually see in the T joints. So you can also modify these T joints. I'm going to this one, and you can also use the, the standard T joint, right? So we can see select over like this. And we can also change our PVC type also, right? So the generic, generic size. So everything we can define over here, right? So uh, this is how we can attach our pipings for the water inlet of the water closet, right? So here now we have to find this pipe. So we can also tap this pipe over here. Can select the velocity of the pipes how much velocity is going on and we can also justify that right so here we can use the pipe fittings also right so we have different types of pipe fittings so here are the cap right so what is generic right so here we have this cross so like this we can place this junctions to whichever part we record we can convert there so here we have the t-joints and here we can see also the t-joint with elbow right so i'm going to change this to we can change it right so everything we can change by category and the size size of the pipe everything we can change over here So we have some shadows. So if you want to see this in rendering, you can see it in rendering also, right? So if you go to click on RR, so the rendering tab will open, right? So if you click on that, click on rendering, so it will automatically render it, right? So, but here it's not visible because we are in the back side of our right? So, we should be at this side, right? So, if you go to again RR, click on RR for rendering, click on render. So, it will automatically render, right? And adjust the exposure right so if we adjust the exposure we can see our toilet right so here we can see right so if we go to the best quality drafting we can see this all as a best quality right so this is how we can add the Piping to any type of closets, right? Thank you.